I know it sounds sordid, but you'll be rewarded when at last I am given my dues with injustice deliciously squared. Be prepared! Welcome back, Mangler3M here. We're going to continue with uh, another Eden. Uh, just had a huge change. We finished the, the beginning or the Ogre Wars segment. Um, and then we appeared in our house. And I haven't actually talked to anybody. I just stopped the stream last time. So we'll continue with that. And I think it, has, it sounded like the game was already going. <laughs> there we go. Alright, here we are. We just appeared here. Nobody to fight right now. We kind of, this is like our, our beginning section apparently. This is the may the mayor's house. And we got some beds where you can like sleep in and stuff to heal. There we go. Alright, let's talk to the kitty. Take Vero with you. Your current cat will return home. Okay, no. Sup, Aldo? Peace has returned to this land of ours. Guess you and I and me are really fam real family now, huh, bub? All the clothes have been neatly organized. Hot diggity, living under the same roof as Fane and Aldo. That's the life for me. This quest, I have to finish this new thing called the Closed Off Open World and the Azure Rebel. Which is at the Riftbreaker deck. Okay. So if I want to continue that, which I probably will at some point. Alright, let's talk to my sister. I was so unsure of what would happen once Altena was turned into that sword, but it's a relief there was no harm done. I'd like to go visit Conium. Hey, would you... why don't you take me with you? And then this is the mayor quest. This is a training quest. You have to like beat him and he's got some kind of weird, you're not allowed to do this. I'm not gonna do that. It's kind of frustrating right now. Very well, come again. Okay, so this says go to the Riftbreaker deck. Um, I'll go to the Riftbreaker deck, but I want to look around just in case anything's changed. Let's see if there's any new weapons. Dole wand, that's all there is. I'm sure I don't have enough for that. Yeah. A level 55 tabber. That is an upgrade, only a slight upgrade, but it is an upgrade, that's interesting. Espada. Anyway, uh, just boring stuff. Let's talk to her. Aldo, you're back. How's the sword treating you? Hmm, the cat, madam. My repertoire has expanded further. All sorts of stuff you can dress your cat in. Okay, we got nine things we can add to our cat. We can add a flower, a hat, a different kind of hat, frog hood, purple visor, different colored capes.
Doesn't look like too much new in this town. Alright, we'll go to the Rift Breaker, I suppose. We'll see what is there. They're telling me to go to Baroque We It says you have to do the Rift Breaker first, so let's go there. Let's... Woohoo, I'm alive and online again. I feel like blasting something to celebrate. Yeehaw, here we go. It says on deck, but I don't see any. I'll take you places you couldn't reach on your own. Let me know and I will chart a course. Oop, Yana and Nilva. Okay, I'm not sure about those. This is the deck though. Closed off open world Azure Rebel. Oh, is that like a is that like one of the special quests? Symphonies? Idea where they're supposed to go. Hmm. We'll try this one. I know. This one's a pain, but we'll try it. See if we can get over the hump now. Intermediate. Magic defense. Brace yourselves. Lecture. This time's about defenses against magic attacks. I set up some training back for this. Use everything you've got because I won't go easy on you. Just like that. Do whatever you like. Try something out. Surprised, were you? This training bag can use fire type magic attacks. Two ways to protect yourself against magical damage from your opponents. Either reduce their intelligence or increase this type resistance. This is a critical point. I'll show you how it's done. Order me to use mind aura. Ho ho ho, that's good. Damage is a little lower this time, but. How much did it change? Whoa, all the way down to four. How about that? That doesn't hurt at all compared to last time. In the middle of battle, opponents with de decreased intelligence will do less damage and allies with increased type defense 
resist more. This is the secret to defending yourself in intense battles. Many other skills out there. Learn everything you can about the skills and strengths of your allies. I move forward. Okay. Good job, you're doing very well. Take this, it should be of use to you in future battles. Another EXP badge. Now, what do you want to learn? Let's do special series. Now, what do you wish for? Notes on statuses. This time I'm going to teach you about a bit of a strange skill. There are some skills that strengthen when the opponent has some status effects on it. Better to see it with your own eyes. Which should I show you? Use everything you've got because it won't go I won't go easy on you. Just like that. Do whatever you like. Try something out. I used it and then it did the same thing on me. The skill I just used wasn't anything special, right? But something happens when this exceptionally boring skill is used while an opponent has a status effect. Quickly try it out on for me. Try doing something, Aldo. Inflict poison on all targets. One damage. Sorry about that, although I inflicted you with poison. Okay, let's try that boring skill we just used. Watch the damage. The damage you receive increased, right? That's because the skill's damage increases the status effect of the target. You must be aware of the enemies it uses, otherwise you'll be in real trouble. Put pain on all enemies. Okay. Ho ho ho, let's add the pain condition. Now let's use the previous skill again. Damage increased even more than before, right? There are times when multiple status effects add together for even more damage. Leaving a status effect on your allies is dangerous, so don't forget to remove them. Statuses. Don't you remember, although there are skills that increase damage when poison, pain, and other effects, status effects are used. You should remove those status effects from your allies as soon as possible. We have to keep going. Good job. You're doing very well. Now what do you wish to learn? Uh, Rage Encounter. Brace yourselves. This time I'm going to teach you some strange skills. Rage Encounter attacks. It's easier to understand through actions rather than words. Okay, try attacking the training bag. Inflict Rage on all enemies. Oh ho oh, oh, ho, you attack me instead of the training bag, right? This is called Rage. Combine this with defensive skills and you'll create a perfect defensive wall. Physical Aura. The ally will draw attacks from another targeted ally and the damage will be reduced. This tactic has no flaw. Next, let's look at counter attacks. Attack Start. X Edge. Did you notice that? After you attacked me, I answered with my own attack. This counterattack pairs well with rage. It reduces damage on your allies while also dealing damage. Let me summarize this. You can protect your allies by increasing your defense and then drawing attacks. You can turn almost certain defeat into victory by using counter skills. Who has counter? None of my main characters do. Good job, you're doing very well. Now what do you wish to learn? Cyclone Wind. This lecture is about Cyclone Winds. Quickly Aldo, watch carefully as I get blown away. 
free home. I just disappeared. It really surprised you, right? You'll get blown away back into the reserves without any say in the manner. In the manner. On the in the matter. Ho ho ho. I'll show you again. Can't bring him back. Here they come. That this time only one of you are in front. Basically, this means that all members of your team cannot be blown into the reserves. This attack deals no damage, but it can affect the party's strategy and put you at a disadvantage. If you're getting hit by cyclone winds, your priority is to regain your attack back. Hostiles eliminated. Good job. You're doing very well. Take this. It should be of use to you in future battles. More experience badge. Now what do you wish to learn? Let's try the graduate series. Let's try attacks. Well, well. Aldo, do you think you can pass this test? Beat me using the things I taught you in the beginner's class. You're not allowed to use a sword in your hip. Okay, we're alright. Alright, let's try lunatic. Let's try... Just trying regular strategies. That's a good one. I'll try stealing just to see what happens. You got six turns left. Alright, that means I gotta hurry up and hit him. Um, this makes all the crit rates go up. We don't need resistance, we just need power. Strong slash. Five turns. Alright, we need you out. Somebody who can damage, that would be you. Tired of practicing. Four turns. Crit goes up. Ha! It's over. Yeah, six fifty six because that critical rate went up. Good job, you're doing very well. Now what do you wish to learn? Defense skills. I saw you coming, you know. Well, well, thinking you pass the test, defend yourself using things I taught you in the intermediate class. You're not allowed to use your sword in your hip, all right? No counters or anything like that. They're probably gonna push me around. Here's, I will need purify because it's gonna do statuses on me. I'm sure. Here they come! Whoa! Did a lot of statuses on himself. Or that was. No weird statuses yet, so I'm just gonna do fortune again, I guess. Hmm, that hurt to heal. Mm, yep, we got blindness on her, so let's do purify. Ooh. That one hurt. Bring you into the front. Keep healing. Pull yourself together. I was tired of practicing. Here they come. Alright, those must be statuses. I don't have the purifier anymore, so I just have to do this. 
comes the big hit coming up. Oh, not done yet. Let's try this one. This one heals as well. Close. Big burn knocked them out. So close. Oh, and finished himself off. <laughs> Much like life. We'll take it. That was a slightly rough. Good job, you're doing very well. Take this. It should be of use to you in further battles. More experience. Well done. Looks like you learned all I can teach you. Yeah, I've gotten the hang of doing combat. Thanks to you, Grandpa. Through. Though it's all meaningless until you start using it in actual combat. The stronger the enemy is, the more useful your advantage come, becomes. Take advantage of that. Yeah, I will. At any rate, you've truly become stronger, Aldo. Looking at you reminds me of the past, and I want to see some action too. Grandpa! I know, for your last lesson, I'll be your opponent. I'm a little fired up now. Ha! Huh. Uh, oh no, the cane will be... Grandpa, you okay? Uh, I'm fine, but the cane didn't make it. Much to my chagrin. Looks like our showdown will have to be postponed for now. Come back anytime you feel like revising your battle tactics. Sure, thanks Grandpa. I thought I was going to have to fight him. I thought it was going to be like the biggest boss in the game. Okay, so we just got a whole bunch of experience badges. Let's see if there's any that are better than our current ones. kind of doubt it, but maybe. Okay, we have a 31 that's not being used and a 21. So there's some people that will benefit from it. You'll benefit from the 30. Thank you. You'll benefit from the 20. it for the main people. We'll worry about the rest of it. Oh, look what we got. We got a bunch of new records, I believe. And what we get from that is a new character, or a new set of characters. Get a lone encounter. You can pick anybody. Uh, let's go with that. Let's use that. And it's a cane. Okay. And then we've got. Ava, Noble Blossom, Fireside Cat, Moonlight Flower, Rose Unseen. Let's try Rose Unseen. Got a Knigget, Notori. 
increased pride. May again. May with the mace. Dean. A robot. Another Kinigit. Uo. Ooh, this is a higher one. Four star Chio with a class change. Now an elementalist. Rufus again. Lavinia again. Zilba again. Another higher up one. Lavinia as a four star, so nobody knew. <laughs> Alright, this says Following conditions to progress The closed off world And the azure rebel And the game cr crashed It's a weird place to crash Right in the middle Or is it my mouse back? Maybe my battery back on my mouse it is my mouse. My mouse is dead. Let me change this real quick. Give me one second. Last battery. There we go. All right, closed off open world and Where could it be? Maybe the map would show something. Okay, so we've got... Seeing anything too obvious or eye opening. I do kind of recall somebody saying something's going on in correct swampland. Let's walk over there and see if I see anything. If I can't find it, I'll just start doing quests. I've got a lot of quests I haven't done yet. All of which I want to do at some point anyway. As you kind of. Alright, so I don't see anything. Let's pick a quest. Um, in progress. Let's start with the in progress ones. These all are, are all about gathering items, making money, and getting weapons. I don't see any really interesting subquests. Try episodes. In progress. Receivable. Stray Cat's Invitation. Let's try that one. Group finds an unfamiliar cat on the Rift Breaker. They follow it, hoping it's to find its home. Starting location Rift Breaker. Requirements. Set it as the priority quest, and maybe they'll direct me where to go. I'm on the deck. Does that count as the Rift Breaker? Or do I have to go inside? 
probably have to go inside. Aha, they are directing me here. They say, I'm on the cabin floor. Here's the kitty. Start the quest. What's a cat like you doing in a place like this? When did you come aboard? It's no good. I just can't speak cat. I'm gonna tell the synth hydra anyway. Maybe he'll know something about it. Hey there, synth hydra. What's the deal with this cat? Ah, the cat. It snuck on board while I was waiting for you in 300 AD. I did try to get rid of the cat at first, but... It made itself at home, right? Who could deny a polite request from a young lady? Certainly not a gentleman battleship like myself. Just call me Synth Hydra Z. So she's a girl, is she? I say, you little minx. How do you like the polish and caliber of my cannon, cannon huh? I see, no eye for the big guns, huh? Don't go meowing that you're homesick. You you boarded on your own accord. Hey, you speak cat? Do I speak cat? Of course not, but it's clear as day. Hey, Master Hydra, this cat's got somewhere to be. Let's take her there. Or so it seems. Any objections, Aldo? None. We can't just leave her here after all. To 300 AD then, wherever the cat takes us. If cats could travel through time. Now we get to see what happens. Where are we now? We're flying west-southwest over Baroque, your hometown. What? What's with the fidgeting? Do you want to get off? In that case, prepare for landing, so somewhere open... Ah, uh, over there will do nicely. I'll disembark with her, but I'll be right back. Don't make a mess while we're away. While I'm away, okay? Well, but the place is deserted. Okay, it's time to head back to the Synth Hydra. What was that noise? Hey, stop that, leave me alone. What was that scream? It came from over there. I better go and have a look. Now you can travel to the mining village. Mm. Deserted house. Nothing and nobody in here. Oh, somebody's hurt and there's some trees moving their arms. Don't eat me. I'm all skin and bones. I'll give you heartburn. 
Are you alright? I'll chase off these off in no time. Say your prayers. Not that it'll help you. Crikey. Guess I underestimated ya. Phew. You saved my life. Thank you. Um, who are you? I'm Aldo. W what are you doing here? I'm... Well, this place used to be a lively mining village. It's hard to imagine now, but this used to be home to lots of people. There was a village here? Yes. I want to have a look around the village. But if monsters are going to attack me like that, then... I'll stick around for a bit. You seem to have your own reasons. I'll be scouting about, so if you get attacked, call me. Like you just did. Thank you so much. My name's Marlo. Pleased to meet you. Look around the village. Whoa. Huge cliff. Your rocks. This boulder is blocking the way. A small sized explosive looks necessary. Let's look around the village for now. I think we've looked pretty much everywhere. A whole lot of nothing. There's clearly no one here. Well, if there were, the grass would be wouldn't be so overgrown. Is that the entrance to the cave? He said there used to be mines here, didn't he? Maybe the mines were exhausted and everyone left. Marlow must be finished by now. Let's find out. in the deserted house. Looks like it could collapse any second now. Well, I suppose that's the fate of all the houses around here anyway. Hey Marlo, are you done yet? Oh Aldo, I made my decision. Decision? About what? I'm going to fix up this house and live in it. What? Seriously? Yeah, seriously. It'll take some hard work to fix up. First, I'll need to tidy up and give it a good clean. Those gaping holes need fixing. But even if I wanted to gain lumber, all I've got is this mining hammer. I'll just have to get some stone to block them up instead. Don't mean to help, I'm quite good at heavy work. My backpack holds five million pounds. No, I can't make you do everything for me. Don't worry about it. People help people. Alright. If you're sure about it, I can't thank you enough. Here, have my hammer then. You got an old mining hammer. I'm sorry it's so old, but you should be able to quarry stone with it. The entrance to the mine, mountain mine is in the north of the village. Okay, I'll be right back. Mine 50 stone. Mine one first layer. While you're in the mine, tap places that sparkle to collect materials that you can use in the village. Mined materials will replenish with time. Try checking back at spots you might have mined before. Miner, forager, and logger. Specialist characters. Some characters have miner or forager personality traits. 
having these characters in your party will allow you to get more materials than usual. Oh, so I need a mining team. There's a minecart rail. If you do a safety check, you'll be able to use it. All right, let's check and make a mining team. Let's see. How do you know who's a forager and who's an order? Only play in order. Can't change characters? Maybe not today. Maybe in the future if I want to come back and mine this place. Some games have places you want to just mine and go back. Oh, I see something over here. Stone 4. Boulders blocking the way. Need an explosive. Fighting brings nothing but sorrow. Oh, my healer worked faster than my attack. I got some clay out of them, too. Broken ladder. If you change it, you should be able to climb up. Change it. Hold. Gunpowder. Unlit lantern. Lit things should get brighter. Too dark to go on. So I have to go back and have to blow up some boulders. Some bigger ladder. And turn on the light. No explosives yet. Say your prayers. Not that it'll help you. I mined 50, so I think we're done with the main quest. For yourself, Everything is for the divine. I saw you coming, you know. Pull yourself together, beauty mate. Another broken ladder. More coal. Rail is sound. You can place if you place a minecart down, you can use it. Deep hole. Rope would allow me to go down. Okay, so I'm at the end of the track. So I've reached everything there is to reach. Let's go back outside to the mining village. I'm too lazy to walk. And give her the stone, and she's gonna he's gonna replenish the windows. Here's the stone. Is this enough? There's fifty of them. Thank you, it should be. So I patched up the holes. Good job, but are you gonna live here? Of course. I 
You can't leave the village in a state like this. Why are you so interested in this village? No one lives here. I was born here, and this house is actually the house I used to live in. Is that right? Don't look at me like that. There has to be a reason I was able to return here. And that I met you so coincidentally. I see. Well, I'll help you in any way I can. Thank you, Aldo. Right. Time to get my village back. I've got big dreams. This is going to be the finest mining village on the continent. All right, chapter one, complete. All started by a mouse, I mean a cat. Probably start two right now. A father's will. Restoring her right. Marlo wants to restore the village his father loved. Aldo tries to help out here and there. I may have set out my objectives, but nothing's going to happen if I'm the only villager. I've got my adventure to get back to, so I can't leave here with you. I suppose not. First thing I need to do is find someone else willing to be a villager. The people that we mentioned. We won't find them cooped up in here. Let's head outside. This episode is a little special. Clearing quests in the village will allow you to progress through the episode. Extras, mining village. New quests and events may be triggered in villages. You can also help out villagers to, de help to further develop the village. Ask around for hints when you're not sure where to go next. It is now time to reclaim this village. Let's head outside. You never know. There might be a new discovery awaiting us. If you're not sure what to do, ask Marlo. He may be able to give you useful information. I see a quest. The first step to recovery, knocking on the village door. Marlo decides to rebuild the village and it starts with the sudden arrival of a young man. Hey, where the heck am I? Oh, hello! Welcome, sir, to Harai Village. Harai? What kind of name is that? Same one the old village of Harai had. I thought I, if I hoped to restore it to its former glory, I should start by keeping the same name, too. Well, it might be Harai, but it ain't much of a village. More like an empty, more of an empty patch of weeds, by the looks of it. Urgh. I promise you, it may look like that now, but one day it will be as vibrant and prosperous community. It'll be a vibrant and prosperous community. I'll make sure of it. And how would you plan to do that? I, uh, well, by having more people stay here bit by bit and then securing the infrastructure of the community and then, uh, then you live here too, Spiky. Uh, no, I'm just lending Marlo a hand. Wahaha, so you're telling me this village is just you and no one else right now. What a hoot. Excuse me? Well, it's rather rude of... I've made up my mind. I'm living here too. What? What? The village needs more villagers if it's going to get back to its glory days, right? Is that a good thing? Of course, but are you sure? It's a big decision after all. No time for spur of the moment life changing changing decisions like the present, right? Name's Terry. Good to meet you. 
It's it's great to have you on board, Terry. Terry became a villager. Happy music. All right, now I just gotta work out a place to live. I'll start by chopping some wood in from the forest. But who will do the actual construction? We don't. But what? You gotta learn to shut up and chill sometime, Mr. Mayor. But Mr. Mayor, me? Well, ain't you in charge here? I suppose so, but I would never regard myself as with such self important Well, if you ain't, who is? There's me, who does the login and the easy car carpentry, and there's you. There's nobody else to be the mayor, mayor. Wait, you're a carpenter. Yeah, and the lumberjack all rolled into one, so building houses ain't a problem, trust me. I'll even fix up that old shack of yours. Just leave it to me. Is there anything I can do to help? Actually, yeah, there is. I can't log and build at the same time, so you can do the logging. Here, it's a little old and worn, but it does the job as good as any other. You got old felling axe to go along with your old hammer. By the way, through the but the way through the forest is blocked off by some very tall grass. Then I'll have to cut it down, won't I? Thanks in advance, Aldo. No problem, I'll go get you some lumber. Alright, this is like one of those city building games. They're trying to fit into the city building farming gathering funness that was popular you know, one, one day. Harvest Moon I think was my peak. I played it on Game Boy and that was burnable resin. Hmm. I touched the ivy and I didn't itch. Alright, we got enough lumber already. There's four in that tree. Oh no, it's a Mackie. Ay ay ay. Whatever will we do? Ah, oh, the trial is over. Raw cotton. There's gonna be nothing left in the forest. Actually, you don't really need to heal, do you? Uh, let's just, uh... Let's switch out the lunatic with you. Everything is for the divine court scene. A field of nothing. That's kind of cool, but nothing there. I'm going to real quick change my characters. All right, so. Head back. Kill them all. Pull yourself together.
I keep telling you. He ain't got to keep up that Mr. stuff with me. Terry is just fine. I, I'm sorry. It's hard for me to get used to being called mayor, let alone addressing someone without a proper title as if I really am one. I got you the lumber you wanted. Will this do? This is some real nicely chopped lumber. It can't be your first rodeo, right? Well, back home I used to help my gramps chop wood sometimes. Ha, ah, good thing for me. You didn't you did cause this'll make for a real nice little place for me to live. I'm gonna start building it right now. Talking to special characters will bring up the requests screen. The request screen will allow you to make requests which are unique to each character. Material requests. Building or mining materials can be given to villagers to make tools or buildings. Construction times will be different depending on what you're making. Time is measured by the number of battles you've fought. Ask Terry to build the lumberjack's house from the request screen now. Order for Terry. Alright, what do you want me to build? Lumberjack's house. Build request. L30, you need 15. Build time, short. Build request. Request received. I reckon I'll be at this for a while. I don't like to do things in half measure. I do know what you plan to do in the meantime, but I'm sure you'll figure out something. Sure. By the way, Aldo, I found this when I was rummaging through the things left inside my house. I thought you could use it. Ladder acquired. Now you'll be able to reach previously inaccessible areas deep within the mine. Thanks, with this I should have no problem going back and forth between levels to the, in the mine. I'll head there and see what I can find. I guess time passes with each battle, villagers will make progress with their individual tasks. Try fighting the monsters in the forest and mine near her ride to pass the time. You might even find some unique items. Alright, we got the ladder, so let's go back in there and go explore. Obtained rewards. Alright, this is the mine. Let's find all those broken places. Not you. Mine part, we don't have that yet. There's a broken ladder. The boulder I need exclusive for. Here's a broken ladder. Let's use my real ladder. Okay, we're at first layer. Went up a level. Leave no one left alive. Sand, coal, still need some light, alright Lux, time for some good fun, pull yourself together, beauty mate, mmm, that's better. We need a rope. Alright, let's see if we can take our ladder away and move it to somewhere else. It looks like no. Or maybe when we go to the other ladder place, they tell us we need to move our ladder to there. Boy, it sure has been a long while since the construction began. I wonder if Terry's done by now. I should get back to her eye and find out. Alright, we'll go back for one second. I just want to check this out. Oh, it's a light thing, so let's go back to her eye, the village. Okay. 
Okay. That looks a nice, my, lot nicer house. Look at that. Well done. Even as an upstairs. Whoa, you seriously built that all by yourself, Perry? The craftsmanship is spectacular. Look at this, all this detail. And it's so sturdy. And if that wasn't amazing enough, my ramshackle old house looks like a completely new building too. Well, what else did you expect? I told you I didn't do things in half measures, didn't I? Or I should have no trouble welcoming more new villagers now. And it's all thanks to the two of you. Thanks so much, Terry and Aldo. Anytime you need something built, you know where to find me. As long as I got the materials, I'll make you anything you need. I'm sure I can make some old, some useful tools for your adventurers. Spelunking and whatnot. Thanks, I'll be sure to call anyone when I need something made. And I'll be sure to get you lumber when you need for it. You can help make construction requests to Terry. A new villager. Our next villager, sing us a song. Not long after Terry, another villager comes to her eye. He seems to have come to the village in search of, in search of something. Well, what's this? The vestiges of human activity here? I lost my way, perhaps. Oh, gentle sirs. I know you perchance of a ancient mining village by the name of Harai. Hello there, are you a traveler? If you're looking for Harai, well, you're here. Indeed. I've heard tales of a mining village in these parts, but in truth fully expected it to be abandoned. Oh, I have yet to introduce myself. I am Henry, nomadic, bard, and worldly scholar. Really, Reality is stranger than fiction, and so with my travels I am to capture its absurdity in song. So are you here to find some fresh inspiration for your verse? Nay, friend, not on this occasion. Amongst the legendary poets there is one who sang about the village of Farai. Or, more specifically, the great one that slumbers at the heart of its mind. Really? I have a letter from my father which says the same thing. Is that so? I had thought it nothing more than a tale of old, for old wives. Interesting. Have you fellows taken a look inside the mine for yourselves? They say that at its deepest point there is a vast hole that leads to the very center of the earth. What? That doesn't sound very safe. Well, you know what they say about poetry. It tends to exaggerate for entertainment's sake. I'm sure there's no serious danger there. A big hole, huh? I have a feeling I saw something like that when my father took me to the mines one. It looked like you could reach to the reach the bottom of it if you had a rope, though. So half the rumor is true. That more than warrants further ex investigation. But the mine is teeming with monsters now. You can't just go in and explore it freely like my father and I did in the past. Want me to go for you? You seem like a trustworthy man. That may not be a bad idea. If you could do so, I would be most grateful. My only concern is the rope. I'm going to need something pretty sturdy. I don't want it snapping when I'm halfway down. And allow me to make it for you. A nomad such as I tends to acquire a great many useful skills on his travels. All I need is a suitable place to work. In fact, I suppose I shall be here for some time, and as such, should erect a temporary workshop here. Got you covered, Terry can make it for you. Henry became a villager. Alright, 
What do you need me to build? I've unlocked harp, wall plate, floor tiles, and bard's house. Okay, if I want bard's house, I have to have the harp, the plate, and the tiles. So I have to start with the harp. I do have stuff for that, so let's do it. Start with that. Okay, if I want a wall plate, I need more lumber. If I want tiles, I need more more sand. I think you can get lumber from trees, and I think you can get tiles from fighting people, quartz sand, or from mining. Need reward. another loan encounter that just appeared all of a sudden. Let's use that before we lose it. It's one of those use it or lose it type thing. Three star. It's me again. All right, so we got to collect sand and lumber and fight people. All right, lumber's here. I don't know if this is. Gonna have any trees left, or do we have to come back at a later time? That's the one we have here. I like it. Four times. We'll get some more stone and sand and all that. Can go also I want to look into these new houses that were just built. Mm, no exploring it's all. But it's a nice place. This one that just got built or fixed up. Recognize that. See, a question mark is probably going to say go mine for sand. I do wonder what this great one is that Henry keeps talking about. But before we dive into any mysteries, let's build him a nice place to work. Go we'll talk to Terry whenever you're happy. looking for something to build new. He'll be happy to help. I need explosives to get into this side. Yeah. Don't have explosives yet. Need a cart. I 
will expose their sins. Mention it. There's some sand? Okay, so I think I've got all the sand I need. It'll probably alert me when he's done building. Uneven bedrock. We have visitors. I think there's nothing else up here because it looks like I got everything already. Yeah. Say your prayer. Not that it'll help ya! No ladder right now. I used it in the other area. Docking station, that's nice, and a hole. Fighting brings nothing but sorrow. Eh, not even worth mentioning. More sand. At least I need to do multiple of whatever else I need to sand for. Kill them all. Die. Alright, I think that's it. Yep. It doesn't say I'm done with everything. So I just have to keep fighting stuff, so let's go back. Actually, let's go bug him and see if he's done. Alright, we need him to build that. Oh, it was instantaneous. No, that's waiting for stuff. Silly me. Alright, another quest for the house. Alright, I'll have it done before you know. Explore while the house is being built. Well, it shows mining right there, but it probably just means because he's a miner, that's why they didn't mark that. He's the builder in there. Alright, we'll explore in here, I suppose. If we appear already done fast. Don't think there's anything else in here. Upstairs in the mine, I suppose. Nope, nothing new. Fighting brings nothing but sorrow. Too dark. I can get a house, and I get a rope, then I can go down and find the special thing in here.
kill them all. It was never in doubt. All right, level up for Amy. Somehow that will have to do. <laughs> Leave no one left alive. Take it. Everything is for the divine. All right, go see Henry's completed house. Nice, looks similar to the other house. Almost as big. Good timing, I've just finished building Henry's workshop. Craftsmanship is excellent, particularly on the inside. I expect that I shall make many a creative masterpiece here. Can't help but think that it's almost too splendid for a mere temporary home. Well, I've never been a fan of half measures. Go big or go home. You know what I mean? Speaking of going home, that's exactly what I'm going to do now. If you need anything else, you know where to find me. You too have my gratitude. I may not be much in the way of things, but here. While I'm here, I would be delighted to craft for you whatever amenities you may need. The first of those shall be the rope. If you need anything else, do not hesitate to ask. Hey, thanks. I will. You can now ask Henry to make items. There, what do you need? Rope, torch, or string? Um, rope and torch. I don't know what the string would be for. Okay, you need string to make a rope. Okay, so I'll say, get me one string. And then I need three more. I can't do a torch yet? Oh. I should have gone with the torch first. You need cotton to build a So I need to get more cotton. No more people here now. I just go get find find cotton. Cotton was over here. Maybe they replenished all this area. Got my cotton. Fighting brings nothing but sorrow. Alright, we 
got a torch. And light lanterns that have gone out. Let's give another string too. We need four for the rope. What could this guy do for me? Anything? He can get me another hammer, another axe, or a glass window. A stone hammer. For copper. Oh, if I need copper. Greens, well, easy to obtain. Okay, so maybe an advanced building later on would need that. Uh, let's get the stone mining hammer before we go to see if we can use that and if it's better at gathering. the torch first. Let's start with the first section. Not here. Here. Okay, we lit up a new route. Kill them all. It was never in doubt. Gunpowder. Hey, copper. What can we do with copper? I don't know. Nothing yet. So that torch was probably used up. Let's just double check. I saw you sure coming, you know. See if I can use the copper here. Is there anything I can use the copper to make? Nope. Let's check with the other guy. It's not saying anything. Floor tiles, but what do you do with the floor tiles? I don't a ladder would be nice. If we get lumber and a string, we can get another ladder. I think that should be our next goal. Another ladder. String for rope, string for ladder. String is highly needed. I missed a spot apparently. Or maybe they're just appearing little by little as I get into fights. I saw you coming, you know. And so the world turns. Much like See, those gave up lumber too. Just gonna go back and forth to the cave. Forest, cave and forest.
Mission in. Nothing here. We just need one more string, and then we can build a ladder. Everything is for the divine. Hey, this is trouble on that. Now one of that's in there. I saw you coming, you know. Come on, give me string. Mention it. Still need one more string. Build a window, but where do you do that? Those are like comfort things. Not useful for me right now. Alright, here's some string down here. Standing there.
Maybe if I leave the village and come back, everything will be refreshed. How do you leave the village? There is no exit. I'm trapped. It's not string, I'm gonna move on to that left nova quest and maybe we'll come back later in time while I play. Yeah, that's okay. Alright, here we go. Going up. Get some food, I haven't done that in a while. These guys. Oh ho, look who's here. I seek to find my true self by confronting the strong ones. Meeting you like this, it's most is most definitely a sign. Justine and Caroline. It's like someone envisioned the cognitive existence of the strong ones. Cognitive existence. Prisoners, time to get reform. It is our duty to determine whether you are a threat or not. The search is for the true self, which I do by watching others fight. I myself do not understand what I am. All I know is that what I, when I see someone take on the strong ones, my heart goes a flutter. However, as I have no memory, there's no one that I can talk to. That's why I want so badly to see a friendly competition between someone and the strong ones. You're not falling asleep, are you? I will test your abilities now. Show me what you've got. If it's not too much to ask, would you fight the strong ones while I watch? You'll get what's coming to you. How's that sound? You want to fight the strong ones? Sure. So that's what it's going to be. Let's see what you've got. The area is fitting for this situation. It's responding to your will to fight. Just don't get knocked out before it gets interesting. Give it everything you've got. Caroline is checking things out. Justin is checking things out. Justine, I should say. No game. Herculean strike. Cannot continue. They'll be taken to the following location. Okay, so they crushed everybody. Oh, all the people died and people Holy that came back. Tessa. Once more. That's it. If you intend to challenge us, you're going to need to at least entertain us. Did not see that one coming. 
That was quite the show. It is difficult to put into words, but I think I'm closer to finding my answer. I'd like you guys to come back again if you don't mind. If you're able to prove yourselves further, then surely you'll be rewarded. Anyway, here's your reward. Prolific debuff res, part of the phantom themes. Or resistance or something. I'll stay for a little while contemplating meaning. Should the path exist, we will see each other again. Until then. Return to Lectiva, yeah. Does everybody have one hit point? Nope, everybody's perfectly fine. Alright, let's see if my string showed up. Something showed up, but I don't think there's a string. This is like cotton. Can you turn cotton into string? This is a question. Oh, you can give me string. I'm going to go into the wrong place all this time. I should have just made it over here. I'm going to make another torch. Uh, I can make another string. Let's get some more strings. Alright, let's get that rope. And we'll use the last bit of string for the other thing. Lumber 19, let's get the torch. We're loading up on supplies. Oh, and there's a quest in that direction. Ladder? Oh, I used up my two strings. <sighs> string, string, string. It's okay, we have a torch, so we have ways of going. We can get more strings. There's a person over there. How'd she get there? Fighting brings nothing but sorrow. A wanderer without a home. Aldo meets a woman in the forest. For whatever reason, she doesn't seem to want to talk about herself. Well now, who are you? And what are you doing here? Hmm. Me? Oh, well, there's this mining village nearby that this one guy's trying to rebuild, and he asked me if I could lend a hand, so I... Wait, why am I the one explaining myself? What are you doing all the way out here, man? What am I doing out here? I'm having myself at my daily promenade. That's what? In a monster-filled danger zone like this. It isn't safe here, ma'am. If you live nearby, I could make sure you get home safe. The name ain't ma'am, it's Rebecca. And I'll tell you the truth. To tell you the truth, I have no home to go back to anymore. Why? What's happened? You said something about a plan to breathe life back into this ghost town. Tell me, how's that going for you? It's still in the early stages of development, but then I'll be a perfect addition to the team. 
I worked at a furnace shop in another life. I'm sure someone that's handy with a kiln would be useful to you. Right. Well then, let's be off. It was that way, right? Hey, slow down there. It, it'd be great to have you on board, but first I gotta ask Terry to build you somewhere to live. Rebecca became a villager. A forest villager. Some people are hunters, some people are gatherers. Alright, refreshed everything in the forest. Or some things in the forest. wooden plank stuff that they had. Stone furnace and furnace. What about the house? Oh, is it the other person? No, you're the, you're the lumber. A furnace is a house for Rebecca. Oh, wow. Alright, we need the wooden wall plates. That's why we needed those. And the stone furnace and the floor tiles. We need a little bit more coal for the furnace. We need how many wall plates? Three, I think. Oh, we don't have enough lumber. A little bit more lumber, a little bit more. And we need three of these. Alright, we got the tiles. We need glass window for her furnace. Nope. We just need one more wall plate and one furnace, which requires more stone and coal. So we gotta go mining. Let's go mining. I wonder if she could steal Never important useful stuff from me. Probably not. They probably leave out. They probably just give off the basic stuff. Like scrolls and stuff. Alright, we have a rope. Oh no, that's not the hole. Leave no one left alive. We also have a torch. It's not so scary if you get your face. Encountered any dark, darker holes yet? Nope. All right, we need a hole for the rope, and we need a torch, a unlit torch to light with our new torch that we're just hanging out in our back. And not starting anything on fire. No ladder. We accidentally used up the string. No cart. Let's use a rope. Bring it over. Of course, it's dark down there. But it's magically lit. Already lit with a torch. No cart.
All right, copper. All right, torch. Have no something down here. Everything is for the divine. Oh, me out. oh a chest. A murmur script. Yeah, okay. That's a one time not helpful thing right now. Now we need a ladder and probably another torch somewhere and lots of explosives. Fighting brings nothing but sorrow. Show me where I may kill again. I think we have enough coal and stuff for what we needed that for. Oh, another rope. So we need another rope. Probably another torch and another ladder. And then eventually carts. There's another torch. Okay, so possibly two torches. Tiles. How many tiles do we need for the first? Oh, we got enough tiles. We need another wall plate. We need more lumber for that. Don't have a lot of lumber. Oh, furnace. I need five more stone to get that furnace. Just five more. Let's see if we can get any string out of here. Maybe. This looks like cotton, but cotton can turn into string. Forager box. What do you do with one of those? Box made from weaved e uh, ivy increases the amount of cotton you pick. Oh, that would be useful. We need lumber for that. All right, let's use some string. And reset. Just six more lumber and we can get ourselves a ladder. Didn't see any more lumber in here. A few more stone and we can build that stone furnace, which doesn't really help us, but it's something checking off the list. Explosives. That's a cart. Explosives, cart, two torches, a ladder or two. More stones. Okay, that's coal, not stone. Torch. So we need possibly three torches now. 
Alright, Blunts, time for some good fun! <laughs> Shopping list is growing. These are also not stone. Rope. the carts for. Maybe with the cart you can mine more. Oh, an area I haven't been to. Here's some stuff. No one left alive. <laughs> Just exploring because I missed another new ingredient. <coughs> that you, Mr. Pumpkin? <laughs> Alright, stone furnace. Check it off the list. Alright, now we all we need is the wall plate, which requires 26 more lumber, so let's go after the lumber. Coming, you know. Eh, not even All right, level mentioning. up. All right, she can go speed up ten or skill up. Let's do skill up. Oh, we need two for that.
tempting, but I need that ladder first. Here's the last wall plate that we need. Yep. Da 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 da! Okay, now we can build her the furnace. Request received. Alright, I'll have it done before you know it. And he's gone. Explore while that's being built. Alright. Nothing in here. I wonder how many battles until so that's this is battle number one. Or maybe you just leave and come back and then it's just done. Guiding light hammer. Nope. It's not sure I complete. You can't just leave. Two battles was not enough. Where is that new house gonna be? I see her down here. You youngins are so full of energy. Almost makes me feel young again, too. You remind me an awful lot of my husband in his youth. Alright, what do you want me to build? Ah, I can get my ladder I've been wanting for a long time. You can do the ladder while you're building something, huh? Okay. Alright, let's go build, use that ladder. Is pretty far away, like not one of these early places. Like those are holes in the wall, hard. Don't even think they're here at a ladder, but maybe. Nope. Don't think this is a ladder either. We have visitors. sand. Quartz sand? Five quartz sand. And we need light to go any further. So it'll send me right back to the place I've already been. Alright, so that was not too exciting of a ladder place. A 
little bit to mine down here. Hello, Mr. Pumpkin. <laughs> Meowing. He says, I want attention. Too much else in here. Yeah, that's Let's go back to the forest, see if we can get some more lumber. Two more cotton. So two more cotton we get some more string. A little more lumber, we can get a torch. Lots of torches needed. They're like really needed, but they're not that useful. Ladders are like more useful, but more cotton, yay! More lumber up here, I think. Nope. That's not lumber. That's burnable resin. Lame. They're taking it little by little. Oh my goodness. Everything is for the divine. One more string. Quick check to get two strings out of this. This guy's not home because he's building. Aha! Another ladder. We like ladders. Somebody's gonna need a glass window one of these days. Alright, ladder. Nothing but sorrow. 
We have visitors. Keep it. We need that ladder. We need the spot for it. Let's try it down instead of up. We always go up first. Leave no one left alive. Take this off. I guess it doesn't really make sense that down would lead to up, but I know there's like one of these far off places as part of a torch area. Oh, no, here's a ladder place. Nothing makes sense. Everything is for the we went down, we're going right back up. I bet it's going to go right back up to the other side of the first floor that we were just at. Yup. So that ladder would have led to nowhere. Because it's the same spot we just were in. So that was not very useful. I don't know if I need any more ladders. Torches seem like the more useful things now. And so the world turns. Much like life. I need at least one torch and I need at least one rope. And lots and lots and lots of explosives. See that there's a place to mine right up right there on the inside. Can't click on it. Almost. Aha! Finishing a quest. Okay, so I apparently was able to build her house. Now they're laughing. Probably at me for finishing and not coming back and realizing they were done. Oh, it's you guys. Guess what? I've just finished Rebecca's house. Not at all bad for a youngin. Not bad at all. Hehe. <laughs> Ain't it just? Let me know later what you think of, your, of the furnace and everything inside too. I'm gonna... I'm going home to put my feet up for a bit. Come find me if there's anything else you need, okay? Hey Rebecca, it's kind of a belated question now, but I have to ask, are you sure you don't want to go home? My mother always told me to look ahead, not back. Is that why you have you don't have a home to go back to? Well, oh, wipe that sad look and look an expression on your of your face. I'm alright. And who knows, maybe me finding this village was just meant to be. It's funny, I thought my furnace shop days were over. Now I can't wait to go back to the furnace. How exciting! I meant to ask about that. What is a furnace shop exactly? Those ores and minerals you find around, around the village? You bring them to me and I refine them into metals for my furnace shop. Oh, that does sound handy. Thanks, Rebecca. No problem. Anytime you need something refined, bring it to me. My work is top-notch, I guarantee you. You can now ask her to make things.
Okay. What can you make? Copper ingots. I have tons of copper ore, so let's do that. Alright, what do we do with copper ingots? I'm guessing make bars to make train cars or explosives or things like that. I don't know. I'll stop at one for now. I'll probably come back for more later. Quick, take a peek here. So there's more lava. We always need that. Oh yeah, of course. We have visitors. <laughs> And so the world turns, much like life. I'll bet the ingots are for train cars and the next person is probably the explosive person. But what can you do with a train car? Day in the life of Marlo. Aldo, intrigued at what Marlo does on a normal day, decides to secretly follow him. Oh, hello, Aldo. Were you looking for me? Oh, oh, hey there. Just passing through. Yes, I am. Don't you worry about me. Oh, all right. In that case, don't mind me. I've got to go do some stuff. Come to think of it, what kind of stuff does Marlo do on a daily basis anyway? Looks like he was headed for Rebecca's house just now. I'm really curious actually. I know I shouldn't, but I just have to have a quick look at what he's up to. Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and put a cut at the video right there. I know we're not quite done with this village, but it looks like a pretty darn big quest. Lots of different things you can explore and do. And I'm really curious if the stuff I make on this on this little village I can use in other quests, you know, like interconnect them or, or not. I'm not sure. I'd like to figure that one out. I'm just gonna double check see if anybody else is on. Looks like, uh... Oh, our friend Tink Tink Games is on, so I'll raid them for now. Say hi to them. Alright. Looks like there we go. Okay. Thanks for joining everybody. We'll have a wonderful weekend. I hopefully will be able to be on tomorrow. We'll see how things go. See you later.